Hiya, we're thinking about prayer today and uh, Jesus teaching on prayer in Matthew chapter 6 is quite uh, intense. Uh, I've had some real great people help me to pray, uh, minister help me to stay awake praying all night long and um, when I was younger I prayed with this guy at six o'clock in the morning uh, three times a week. Uh, that was great too and, and also another time when I was a teenager um, I, I would go to a, I would walk to the next town along from Bexhill to Hastings uh, and join in some, some kids, some teenagers, young adults, just worshipping and praising and, and praying all together. Uh, some great experiences in prayer. Uh, but here Jesus says, when you come together to pray, you're kind of talking to God, but you're also kind of talking to the other people that you're praying with. You're trying to encourage and motivate them. And Jesus says, go into your inner room. Uh, don't You don't need long, complicated prayers because God's not impressed by that. He just wants you to be yourself, to be real with him. Um, so um, some experiences that might be helpful. My um, When I was really sick, I used this prayer rope, this orthodox prayer rope, and just prayed a very simple prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. And I was really struggling in prayer, really struggling altogether. And I just prayed it and counted the bead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten times I pray. Uh, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, a sinner. Not a complicated prayer, but in, in, in my inner room, quietly, just to myself. And... Uh, the, the reward I got was communion with God, a closeness of God, him coming close to me, because I was focusing on him, not other people. If, you, if you're if you focusing on other people, then your reward is closeness with them. Uh, so Jesus says you get your reward if you're praying with other people, praying in public. It's not just about being the big I am, but you get your reward uh, in, in your bonding with them. Uh, and now he says, do it in private. My mum, bless her, uh, gave everyone a key to her flat and um, people would come in and out as they pleased their friends. And they could often find her talking to herself, but really she was talking to the Lord. She would spend hours in her flat communing with, with God. She wasn't a great one for prayer meetings, but she was a great one for just talking to Jesus, her saviour. So um, I'd encourage you to follow my mum's example. Just find a quiet spot and just chat with Jesus, your saviour and friend. Okay, more on prayer tomorrow, the Lord's Prayer.